their channel. Appreciate everyone, obviously, once again, for tuning in the videos and showing love and support. But I never properly introduced myself to you guys. So in this video, the goal or what I'm going to be doing this time is introducing myself and telling y'all a little bit about myself. Without further ado, let's get into it then. <laughs> So, as the um, YouTube channel says, that is my name, Eliza. Usually go by Eli because only one to two people call me Eliza. My mom and obviously my girlfriend. But when my mom says that, I feel like I'm getting in trouble. So, I'd rather get called Eli. Um, I was born in Germany, uh, kind of on the outskirts of Frankfurt. So... I don't know if that's the capital or not. I don't know. But, yeah, born in Germany. I feel like that's one of the most interesting facts about me. Um, I have two siblings. I have two great parents. Um, and have three dogs right now. One of them is going to be mine whenever the time does come out. Whenever the time does come for me to move out. Um... I'm currently a student or a senior, and correct that, a senior at the University of South Florida who graduates in May. So really excited for that. Obviously, that's a huge milestone um, in in life, being able to accomplish uh, getting a bachelor's degree, especially debt free. That's also another blessing. Um, at the University of South Florida, I'm currently involved um, with my ROTC program. Um, my goal is to become an officer in the Air Force. Um, you can't see it right now, but on my desk, I have about two or three books for the officer's test. I'm trying to make sure that I get a great score because it's about the last thing I really need in order to make sure I can take that step into making sure I'm closer to achieving that goal of mine. But at the University of South Florida, my degree major is political science. So possibly if the Air Force doesn't work out, maybe I'll do law. Um, I've just honestly been intrigued with law because I've grown up around my parents watching a lot of law and order. And I always thought, you know, being an attorney or maybe possibly a judge, I always. <laughs> I've always been involved with sports since a little kid. Uh, love basketball, still play to this day. Staking my claim as the best uh, YouTube hooper right now. Um, love football, also did a lot of football growing up. Kind of dropped it when I did get into high school as I started taking basketball a lot more serious. Um, recently starting to get involved in soccer, so We'll see, maybe one day I'll take my uh, my talents to the pitch. Um, <laughs> but I uh, also did a little, did some track too from middle school to high school. Um, specialty was the 400. Uh, did pretty well in that. And I did long jump and high jump as well. Wasn't as successful in that. Um, didn't really take track too serious. So uh, part of me does wish I did that a little bit too sometimes. But yeah. <laughs> Um, besides that, um, right, sports, uh, school, uh, gym, love the gym. Um, when school ended, is kind of a way for me to continue being active. So it's something I've just been doing for a while now. Um, if you know me personally, you know that I used to be extremely skinny, especially in high school. I used to be a skinny guy, but... After graduating, I definitely put some muscle on, and I'm obviously very happy about that because it's been difficult for me to always maintain a, a lot of mass and put on a lot of mass. So now that I'm at a level where I'm at, I'm pretty happy, but who knows, maybe we'll do a couple gym vlogs too, basketball vlogs. Um, you know, the thing is with this channel, I just don't want it to be limited to just one thing. You know, I just want to be here and there. I want to be able to enjoy my time on YouTube or however long I decide to do this and have fun with it. Because that's the whole point of life. 
no, you don't want to be miserable doing what you want to do, anything you don't want to do. That's kind of something I live by, is uh, being positive and doing things that are obviously are fun or something that's going to keep me entertained for a while. But uh, obviously, those are kind of the main things. Another thing I like to throw in there is I love anime. I'm willing to discuss and talk about that with anybody, any time of the day. I have read and watched uh, hundreds of shows and books, but throw this out there right now. In my eyes, my top three for anyone who is watching anime wise, Cowboy Bebop will always have my heart. That's number one. Number two, Dragon Ball Z, because that's the first one that that got me on the list. That's where I always put it. And number three, One Piece. I don't care what no one says. One Piece is the GOAT. I'm not trying to like bash Naruto, but One Piece got my heart. But yeah, so it's pretty much all there is to me. Um, if there are more questions or anything like that, if you got any comments, uh, any questions, you know, drop it in the comments. Definitely not afraid to uh, reply and answer them. Pretty much somewhat of an open book for the most part. Um, but yeah, that's it. That's me. Uh, not too much. Just a regular guy, as I like to say. But yeah, so thank you once again for all the love and the support. You know, drop a like, leave a comment, and don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Thank you.